Right, Ethan, Miko, it's been quite a season for you so far. You're out here in Dubai and uh, you've both been involved with first team level on the bench, you a couple of times. And we've got an audience that you weren't expecting, so uh, don't worry about that. And then both of you were on the bench for the recent Livingston games, so it, it makes the, the first team that bit closer. Yeah, definitely. It's good to just get involved with squads and that and just keep pushing on in the season. Uh, we've obviously been having two uh, squads have been on the bench and uh, it's just good to get involved, yeah. And Miko, sim similar, you're obviously very, very pally with Ryan Harrington, you both came through the Everton system together, he's out on loan at Montrose and you're over here in Dubai, so you seem to get the better of the deal at the moment. At the moment, yeah, but uh, yeah, I've known him since like seven years when I first went to England, uh, been mates with him ever since and he was a big part of me coming to Aberdeen and helped me settle down really over the year and a half of being here. Um, just looked after me, picked me up in the morning, dropped me off, introduced me to everyone, so it's been a big help for me. Now, um, Ryan is a, a scouser. Um, you're from F Finland, but uh, some would say you sound even more like a scouser than he does. What's the, what's the history behind that? I wouldn't call Ryan a scouser, he, and he'd probably agree with that. He's, he's Welsh fully, so um, no, I've I didn't know much English when I first came over. I uh, had a basic level, but not too much. So every single bit I learned was Scouse in a way. So that's why I've got a weird little accent, but it's sort of fading away now because I don't speak to too many Scouses anymore. And Ethan's totally different to your Inveruri, born and raised and an Aberdeen supporter. And you're here playing for the club, your brothers, Seb's out on loan at Stenhouse Muir. But it's been a wee bit of fairy tale the last couple of years. Yeah, it's been good. Uh, obviously, coming from Kintore, not in Veruri. Sorry, I'll, I'll get that, I'll get that <laughs> right with Ryan as well. Um, no, obviously, coming from Kintore, it's good. Me and my brother, we've come right through. From I think we both come from under 11s, so we've come right the way through contracts and now pushing on with the first team. Seb's obviously out with Stenis Muir, doing all right at the moment, uh, fighting relegation, but uh, we're both doing well and we're both happy. And you've been captain of the under 18 team. The extra responsibility being captain. Yeah, a little bit. Um, different than playing reserves. Obviously, I'm not captain at reserves as Dino, but um, when I play 18s, I take the armband and it's just an extra bit of responsibility. You know, you look at like Shinny with the first team and how he takes the armband and how he is about his work, and you just try and mirror that as much as you can. And there's a lot of injuries to the first team in the early part of the season. You guys benefited from that because it's not just you two, there's quite a clutch of youngsters being involved. Yeah, there's been a few. There's been a uh, Jack McKenzie was obviously on the bench with with Roscoe here uh, against St Mirren, and then there's been Danga who's been involved as well. And there's been quite a few other lads training with the first team and, and being in and around it. But it's it's great for all of us, learning from all the all the players. Um, they've been great with us. They've been helping us, uh, talking to us, feeling like part of the team really. So it's it's been good. And this week. What, will you, what do you feel you'll get out of it? You've been here a couple of days. Obviously, the, the, weather, the weather is conducive to lots of training in, in good conditions. Oh, it's brilliant <laughs> out here. It's better than being back in Aberdeen, out of Bulgarni. No, it's good uh, training in the, the heat and everything and obviously being with the first team. So it's just brilliant to be out here to get the opportunity. And once you've got the taste of being involved with the first team, you obviously it's something you want to continue. Oh, definitely. You just want to be in around as much as you can and perform as well as you can in training, show yourself about and then just see where that takes you, really. And Ethan, in a national newspaper a few weeks ago, you, you, you were um, not slaughtering, just saying a few remarks about some of your teammates. You stand by them? Ah, uh, yeah. Um, a couple of them haven't taken it too well. Brucey, Jacko, but uh, I stand by every word I said. Okay, so Bruce, you, you said we should be the, the one that would be on Love Island from the, the dressing room. Yeah, um, to be fair, he came in, he, he was calling me out and then he was like, you know what, I agree with that. So, <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. And Jack's stress sense received a bit of criticism. Yeah, and I think everyone in the changing room stands by that. I, I don't know if Miko agrees with me, but... Uh, I prefer not to comment. <laughs> no, I stand by that and uh, no, he's not been too happy with me recently. And no comment probably means that Miko agrees I with you. So. <laughs> but thanks, guys. Enjoy the rest of the week. No, thank you. <laughs> 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 <laughs>